assembled in the war room. Aye, aye, sir. Elusive Man. I'm Martin Sheen, and I'm delighted to play the Elusive Man in Mass Effect 3. When we learned there was more to the galaxy than we imagined, there were some who thought the relay should be destroyed. There isn't going to be any question about where he's headed, or who he really is, and what he really stands for. I got this one! I'm Freddie Prinze, and I'm James Vega, all at the same time. James is a new character. He's a very serious, very honest, very straightforward soldier, and he puts emotions aside. Ha! <laughs> ha! You remind me of my old CO. <laughs> that stunt back on Mars was reckless. You're lucky to be alive. You have to play it. It's a completely immersive game. It will make you think. You'll actually care about the characters you're playing. You really get to customize the game. And I think that's what gamers want. They want to be able to make decisions that they would make. And that's a really rare thing. Drop me off someplace, because I'm not leaving. Enough. Sometimes you want to be evil. Sometimes you want to punch somebody instead of saying, yeah, you should have been there. Good to hear it. Joker, what have you got? Sensors show a Reaper parked at the Shroud facility. My name is Seth Green, and I play Joker in Mass Effect 3. He's a solo artist. He's really not interested in joining any groups or bands. He's got a terrible brittle bone disease. Commander, be careful down there. A great opportunity for players to have a game that's so expansive and enveloping. If I knew that Edie was going to install herself, do you honestly think that I'd be able to keep quiet about it? I'm right here, Jeff. Yes, you are, Edie. Yes, you are. I'm Trisha Hoffer, and I play Edie, the artificial intelligence aboard the Normandy in Mass Effect 3. Edie is now faced with questions that she wouldn't have ever been faced with before. Our chances of victory are less than assured. If it's going to work, we need you. Hi, I'm Allie Hillis, and I play Liara Tassoni in Mass Effect 3. She got a little darker, she changed a little bit, and she's starting to become a little bit more human in the way that she emotes. Some of the wounded here won't make it. I'm Jessica Chobot, and I play Diana Allers. I'm incredibly honored to be a part of the game. Up to this point, in all my video game playing, I've cared about what I can do and getting to the end goal. I'm not doing that anymore. I'm playing because I want to see what happens to Shepard. Anderson. You look good, Shepard. My name is Keith David. I'm playing Admiral Anderson in Mass Effect 3. He's a man's man. Every minute these machines are here, thousands of innocent people will die. Millions! Commander. I'm Jennifer Hale, and I play the female Commander Shepard in Mass Effect 3. The writing in 3 is some of my favorite stuff I've ever done. You can't even conceive of how big the war is in this one. If you've never played Mass Effect 1 and 2, the game rewrites itself for you. So you're right there with people who've played the first two, and you don't miss anything. The Reapers are here. I don't think I even have to tell people to go play Mass Effect 3. They're just so good. Mass Effect really adds depth to video gaming. To see a character-driven action video game just doesn't happen. It's such compelling entertainment. The intensity of it has just grown beyond what I thought it could even be. Stay tuned. <laughs> I'm not done yet. <laughs>